Hey guys, Elite Strategies here. Today I'm going to give you a full overlook on the application known as Winterboard. In my opinion, all Cydia users should download Winterboard, as it allows you to customize the overall appearance of your iPhone and add stunning graphic qualities to your mobile device. As you can see, my lock screen has been customized as it has a gradient setting behind the date and time that allows you to see a blurred image of the picture behind it. Once you download Winterboard from the Cydia Marketplace, a Winterboard application will be installed on your iPhone. You can then click on the applications and edit the preferences from the application, or get rid of the application and edit the Winterboard preferences from the settings application. As you can see, there's a setting that allows you to hide Winterboard. If you do this, it will hide the Winterboard application and you will have to adjust the settings from the settings application built in with your iPhone. I personally keep the Winterboard application installed just because it's a little bit easier to access rather than scanning through the system preferences of your iPhone. Once you click on the Winterboard application, you will see a link titled Select Themes. Once you click on Select Themes, you will be able to customize the appearance of your iPhone. In order to download different themes, just open the Cydia application. Then, under the Cydia icon, Click on Themes. From there, you will see some of the most popular and featured themes for iPhones and iPod Touches. Once you download a certain theme from Cydia, you're just going to go back to the Winterboard application. You will then click on Select Themes and select the name of the theme you have just downloaded. After you select the theme, respring your device and your iPhone or iPod Touch will restart with the theme applied to your iPhone. So, I hope this video helped you to gain an overall understanding of the application known as Winterboard, that all Cydia users should use it if you're interested in adjusting the theme of your actual mobile device. And I want to thank you for watching this video, and if you have any questions, just leave a comment below this video, or send me a private message. Don't forget to rate, comment, and share this video with others. If this video has helped you out, I'd really appreciate it if you could subscribe to my channel, mainly because it motivates me to continue making videos. Again, thanks for watching this, and see you next time.